What's going on guys? Welcome back to Sneaker Talk for a brand new sneaker haul, unboxing, mystery box, kinda, not really. I, I kinda know what's inside this box, but the homies over at Foot Locker sent over a, uh, a huge package because I'm actually gonna be in a small little ad campaign with them. So I'll be featured on their Instagram, I believe, and they'll be using like the product photos and stuff on the Foot Locker Canada website. So that's actually really, really cool. Hopefully you guys are doing well. Uh, if you guys have missed a couple of the videos from the recent weeks, make sure you guys check them out. But they came, uh, the package came just like 10 seconds ago and I'm actually gonna go for the photo shoot, I believe in just a moment. It's actually, it's actually a rainy, gloomy day today, but the sneakers actually released in like two days. So the turnaround time for this photo shoot and getting everything up is gonna be really fast. With that said, I'll leave links to all the stuff in the description down below. So make sure you guys check it out and click those links. And if you guys like what you see, let me know in the comment section down below what you guys like the most. But here we go. I haven't done a haul video in a while. So if you guys want some more haul videos, subscribe. I have a lot more heat to show you guys, but we got one pair of Adidas NMDs here. These are a pair of R1 V2s. Whenever I hear V2, I always think of Yeezy Boost 350 V2, but my first pair of NMD R1 V2s. Then we have another pair of NMD R1 V2s. And then we got the clothing for the photo shoot here as well. And uh, yeah, let's start off with the clothing real quick since uh, it's, it'll be quickly, uh, it'll be quick to get through. Black shorts for the summer. They actually have like a, a mesh lining on the inside. So these kind of could almost double as like a bathing suit. This is gonna be a, I wanna say summer essential. One nice touch is they have the uh, the zippers on the side. Adidas embroidery right here on the bottom. And uh, yeah, these look dope. Next piece, t-shirt right here. The white t-shirt with a graphic print on it. This is the, uh, the graphic print on the very top or middle, center middle of the t-shirt right here. Pretty simple. Next up we have the, uh, oh, they didn't include the shorts. They were supposed to include some fancy, funky looking shorts, but I guess not in this package, but let's get to this next piece. This is the Lock Up TT Track Jacket, I believe. This looks pretty dope. And it's gonna match the, uh, the shorts I just showed you guys perfectly. Let me zoom out a bit just to show you guys. Collar right here that does zip up all the way. As you can see, just do a little unzip action right there. Got the Adidas embroidery on the upper chest right there. And then the three stripes, of course. We got the embroidery that matches the shorts on this side right here, also embroidered. And some small little ribbed cuffing at the very, uh, I was gonna say ankle, at the very wrist of the, uh, the jacket right here. They also got some pockets right here, which yeah, they do in fact have zippers. And that is the jacket. Those are the apparel pieces. Next up, let's get to the sneakers. Here we go. These are gonna be my very first pairs of Adidas NMD R1 V2. This model has been out for, I think several months now, almost to, I wanna say eight months, nine months, I believe. So I'll leave links to these in the description down below to Full Locker's website. And uh, this is actually like a special collection. So for them to reach out to me for this campaign, it's really cool and it makes a lot of sense for them, I, I think, to use me based off of the collection for this campaign shoot or this advertising campaign. So let's pop open this lid. And the very first pair is these right here. The black and white Adidas NMD R1 V2s. Oh man, I can already tell. This is going to be a, uh, I wanna say like a summer essential for me. I, I do see myself wearing these an absolute ton. You guys might notice the Japanese writing on the side of it. Is it is it uh, katakana or kanji? Japanese writing throughout the sneaker. We got it on the back right here. It probably says the brand with the three stripes like it usually does on the back of some of the NMDs. And then you have the this sort of sideways, not sideways, diagonal, diagonal print on the boost, which is really cool. And then there's some like extra fortification as you guys can see with the, uh, the two tones of like white that they use. They sort of use like a creamier white here and then it mixes in with this white right here. This is actually from, can you guys guess the name of this collection? It's, uh, it's called the Shibuya Collection. They're doing like a city series collection for various cities around the world. I was actually uh, sneaker shopping the other day and I think I saw pairs for like Brazil, Mexico, and a whole bunch of other places as well. With it being Shibuya, you guys know on Sneaker Talk, we were like one of the first channels to really document and vlog heavy in Japan when it comes to sneakers and streetwear culture. I've been to Japan now seven times vlogging for you guys, showing you guys what is over there and stuff. So it's really cool to see like a Shibuya inspired sneaker and, or a Japanese inspired sneaker, specifically Shibuya because Shibuya is my favorite city in the world next to Toronto and Manila. But uh, yeah, this is the very first pair, the NMD 
R1 V2 Shibuya in the white colorway. I'll leave links to these in the description down below. And you, as you guys can see, these do look really, really good on feet. I'm not sure how these feel in terms of comfort right now, but I'll be sure to let you guys know on screen with some text how the comfort feels. And I will have an in-depth review for these sneakers very soon. So yeah, that's the very first pair, the Adidas NMD R1 V2. And then next up, the next pair of sneakers is also another NMD R1 V2. Pop open this box. And woo, here we go. This one is like a, like the yin and the yang. So you got the white colorway, then you got the black colorway. And in my favorite like kind of color scheme, the bread colorway, black and red. So this is a predominantly black Adidas NMD R1 V2. We of course have the hits of the diagonal print running across the uh, the black boost midsole right here. Or you could say it's a white boost midsole with a black print. Actually, yeah, I wanna say it's a white boost midsole with black print. Japanese writing on the sides as well on the Lego brick on the front. Oh, they actually have like a little Adidas logo. I don't really think we've seen that before. That's pretty cool. They got that going on. We got the bread accents, the black and red accents. We got the, the Trefoil logo, of course. We got the aglets right here for the laces and the NMD branding right by the toe box of the shoe. I gotta say, these are these are really clean. I, I messed with these heavy. In terms of which colorway I, I like more, that's kind of hard because both, both of these colorways are really tough. These are some really solid colorways for the NMD R1 V2. And big thank you to Full Locker for uh, reaching out to me for this ad campaign for the Adidas NMD R1 V2, the Shibuya, uh, the, the Shibuya collection from the City Collection, I believe. So let me know in the comment section down below which sneaker you guys like more, the white pair or the black pair. And uh, I'll also have some on feet right now of this black pair. So here's an on feet look at these Adidas NMD R1 V2s. Uh, of course, we'll have an in-depth review for these sneakers very, very soon. So make sure you guys subscribe, hit that red button, make sure notifications are on so you don't miss a video. That is it for the haul. Again, let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about these sneakers. It's tough. I want to say, I want to say I like this black and white pair a bit more, especially in summer. I'll, I'll be wearing these a ton during the summer months here in Canada. And then probably come the fall season, you'll see me wearing these a bunch. And then I'll probably bring one of these pairs with me to Japan or, or both of these pairs with me to Japan the next time I go. So uh, yeah, this is this is awesome. Thank you again, Full Locker and Adidas for working with me on this. And I'll be actually doing the photo shoot tomorrow morning. So first thing tomorrow morning. And uh, you guys can follow me on Instagram at SneakerTalksEA to see how the photos turn out or check out Full Locker on Instagram. Uh, I think it's Full Locker Cat or Full Locker Canada and of course FullLocker.ca. I'll leave links to these in the description down below. So click them if you guys want to check them out. Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next video. We have a bunch of more news videos on the way along with some sneaker hauls. And of course, if you haven't yet, check me out on Twitch. It's twitch.tv slash sneakertalksca. I'll catch you guys later. Have an awesome day. Peace out.